Hey, this is JC here at JC's Comics and More, your pop culture superstore at 6725 West Central Avenue. That is Toledo, Ohio, 436-1741-531-6097. JC's Comics at Hotmail.com. And then you can find the Facebook information in the description below. Uh, This is Friday, November 19th. I've got this lizard statue to crack open and make sure it's okay and also let uh, people know that uh, sometimes if you guys message me say on facebook once i leave here at night i am off the grid so message me at 10 at night hoping to get a message or at midnight or two or three in the morning or seven or nine and nine in the uh, morning not going to happen i usually get here after 12 noon and I try to answer if I have the chance. If I'm busy in here, then I don't have a chance. Sometimes I might have to answer stuff after I close at night when I think my day is over with. My day isn't quite over. Uh, the other night, uh, last Saturday, with the Amazing Spider-Man collection, I spent almost two hours answering emails and uh, and messages. But uh, we're going to open this thing up and have a look-see. And looking forward to the guy driving up from Georgia tomorrow to buy some of those comics from that collection. So I'm very very honored that somebody is driving all the way from the state of Georgia, which goes to show just what a selection we have here. But we've got a special guest who's going to be uh, recording this. Make sure you put that around your hand there in case you not drop my camera. <laughs> pull this out. This is part of the Premier Collection. From Diamond, it looks like this is number 129 of 8, 812. And ironically enough, the Amazing Spider-Man 129s are the ones that sold right away. So, it's actually, what is it, number 90? Is that what it says? Or is, it that, two, like or is that 2,090? Two, two, 2,009. Like 009 to me, but who knows? This number, that number on there is wrong. See, carton number... Yeah, looks like this is number 90. Man, take a look at the side there. And this thing is pretty damn cool. I want one of these for myself. I might have to reorder it because I want one of these lizards for myself. By God. Dr. Kurt Connors, as he looks exactly in the Amazing Spider-Man film with the lizard. Oh, that's right, he didn't have the lizard head. So... And that's how you uh, screw up a one-car accident in Hollywood. Okay. Look at this. It is. It's number 90. So that's, what, uh, like 3% of the run? Wow. Number 90. Holy crap. Maybe I'll just keep this for myself. Surprised these uh, lizards going to come out because it's a little cold in here. Lizards don't like to come out in the cold; they shrivel up. Okay, we always check our statues here just to ensure that they're not damaged. There are stores out there that do not check their statues. I cannot understand that in any way, shape, or form because say say that the statue's damaged and I don't check it and. Three years from now, somebody comes in and wants to buy it. And it's like, can we look at it? I pull it out. It's damaged. Guess what I, Guess what? Diamond's going to do? They're going to be like, well, sorry about your luck. You know, if I check this thing and it's damaged, I can call it end of the damage, and they'll send me out a replacement. So it's very foolish for stores that do not check their statues. Personally, I would never buy from a store that didn't, didn't check their products like that. That is the top. And I will be taking pictures of this as well and putting it on the shop's Facebook page. And then also, just to interject real quick, we do still have the Captain America Stealth Shield.
Oh, it comes with uh, gummies you can eat. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yum, yum. They might be a little stale. You might get a stomach ache a little bit. And, and that's why I check. That's disappointing. Especially such a low number. It's a low number. And unlike real lizards, this tail won't grow back. Wow. Sometimes life is full of disappointment. That's very too bad. I'll end up taking pictures anyways, just in anticipation of getting a replacement, but and you can see that this wasn't part of the tail wasn't actually part of it, it was glued in. Um, and it looks like Does this even go? Looks like it goes down and curls down. Yeah. Right it curled down there. And then it's actually, you can see here where it was supposed to attach. So it broke from, from both those areas. That's really too bad. I'm, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm very, very disappointed. That's. Well, you can see why I check my statues. I've not had a statue uh, come damaged in a long, 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 long time. Um, but if you do like these videos, please subscribe to the channel because you just never know what you might find. You might be disappointed to uh, find the same disappointment as I find. Uh, but you subscribe, be sure to smash the bell for notification. Be sure to like the video, be sure to share, be sure to comment. Were you as disappointed as I was when you found out the, the, the tail had broken? Um, but other than that, hope everybody has a very enjoyable weekend and a happy and safe Thanksgiving this next week. And I'd like to thank my unknown uh, cameraman, he likes to be unknown. He's, you know, he's shy that way. It's like the Bigfoot. You, you maybe might catch a glimpse and you might see uh, something show up on Paranormals caught on tape. But other than that, thanks again. Everybody have a great weekend.